It's one of the most difficult cancers to treat, but Australian scientists think they've found an effective new way to kill it. Blood cancer is often detected only once it is spread through the body. But a new trial using an old drug is already showing promise. 79-year-old Annette Blackford has enjoyed a lifetime of good health. That was until an urgent phone call from her doctor following her annual blood test. He rang up when the results come back at 5 o'clock that night and said that um, your blood count is dangerously low, get to hospital now. Tests quickly confirmed Annette had contracted leukaemia or blood cancer. And of course I said to Dr Lane, you better fix me, and he said, oh, that's pressure. <laughs> as well as being Annette's doctor, Professor Stephen Lane is also part of a world medical research team. A team that enjoyed a eureka moment after accidentally discovering a new way to kill blood cancer cells with a drug called Amitelstat. It was incredibly exciting for us because we did not expect that. And this is, works by activating a new type of cell death pathway called ferroptosis. Put simply, the drug triggers a previously unknown way to target cancer cells, internal metabolism and fatty acids, causing it to rupture and die without impacting healthy blood cells. And we have now many more hypotheses and ideas on how we can target and induce this type of cell death. Big medical strides for patients around the world facing an otherwise grim blood cancer outlook. So we're collaborating with friends in Germany and also in France and a number of Australian sites to try to offer this treatment to patients with leukaemia who've run out of other treatment options. With the ultimate hope, the treatment will eventually become a broader cancer killer. Tim Collins for 10 News First.